Uh, yeah, uh, all of our teachers are provided a free furnished apartment in Korea. I would generally say that, you know, across the board, it, it probably exceeds their expectations, not to use that term again, but uh, it, it generally is better than what they're probably expecting. I know when my wife and I and my son went to Korea, uh, just before we left, I showed my dad some pictures of our apartment and he just went on and on. He said, oh, it's so great. It's wonderful. And I thought, dad, it's just, just an apartment. Like, you know, it's got a couple of bedrooms and a kitchen. Like, it's no big deal. I almost thought he was making making fun of it and he said no I thought you were going to be living on like dirt floors and stuff and like not have walls I'm like no dad it's a first world country um, yeah but it's going to be a, a lightly furnished apartment uh, it's going to have a bed and blankets a uh, table chair uh, gas range small fridge uh, usually a microwave might be there, you know, depending on what your previous teacher left for you. It's usually going to be within walking distance to your school, which is great. Uh, and the fact that it's free, you know, nobody offers me a free apartment for any job that I'm going to look at here in Canada or in North America, you know, so that off the top is one of your biggest living expenses that you have when, you know, you're living in your Western country.